Hi everyone, in the last video I discussed about how to draw the year diagram, entity relationship diagram. In this video I will discuss about how to convert the year diagram into physical database. So this is our year diagram that was uh, belongs to our project actually, state, city, location, employee. So how to draw the year diagram? These are the rules. Identify the parent entity, identify the uh simple attributes identify the simple attributes identify the key attributes establish the relationship and relation between the entities now how to convert how to convert year diagram year diagram into physical database i have taken a small set requirement okay now so here is step number one convert uh, every strong entity convert every strong entity as database table convert every strong entity as what database table you have to convert the strong entity as database table next step number two convert simple attribute convert the simple attribute as column simple attribute as column next identity convert convert key attribute convert key attribute as primary key so how to convert the database table into uh, year diagram into physical database i'm telling here let us listen all of you so what to do convert every strong entity as table so how many entities are there four entities so create four tables state and other one is city and another one is location and another one is uh, employee so four entities are there now you have to create four tables state city location other one is employee so convert every simple attribute as what column convert every simple attribute as column here you have four tables are there now now what are the simple attributes here state so here is state id and what state name and here you have city id and what city name city id and city name here you have location id and what location name here you have employee number employee name and what salary so convert every uh, uh, entity as table simple attribute as column uh, key attribute as primary key now here apply key attribute the state id is primary key is it clear here red color all red colors are what primary keys here you see in location table location id is primary key primary key will not allow duplicate values primary key will not allow null values you can apply only one primary key on a single table is it clear primary key is nothing but for a table only one primary key will be existing the important column in the table will become as primary key. Now here I will insert some dummy data, state ID, and here state name I will give Telangana state, and here state ID I will give as something like ST1. Some dummy data, state 2, and here I will try to give Andhra Pradesh. State 3, here I will try to give UP, Uttar Pradesh. And here I will try to give city ID, CT1, and here I will give city ID, CT2 and here i will give city id ct3 and here i will give the city names hyderabad and here i will give the city name something like uh, here i will try to give city names hyderabad and you can give another city name something like warangal is it clear is it clear similarly here i will try to give what uh, Here you can give Vizac and here you can give Vijayawada, something like that. Is it clear? Like that, UP, I think you can give Agra, Agra belongs to UP. Na? Agra is data. Is it clear? Okay. Similar location you can take. Location ID you can give lock one. Location name I'll give Gachibowli. In Hyderabad you have Gachibowli is one location. Is it clear? Similarly here you can give Amir Pet. Lock two. This is Amir Pet. And here I'll try to give lock three. And here I'll give some NJD in Vizac. I'll give some location. And here you have employee is there. Employee also will give some data actually. 
is it clear something like this so how to convert the database uh, uh, tables uh, year diagram into physical database you have to convert like this convert every entity as a table every simple attribute as what column key attribute as what primary key is it clear now all tables are created now identify the relationship between the tables is it clear step number four what to do identify the identify the relation and the relationship and the relationship if one to many relation exist if one to many relation exist then one is parent table one is parent table and many is child table is it clear so if the now if one to many or many to relation exist if one to many or many to one relation exist if one to many or many to one relation exist then one is uh, parent table and many is child table now then the primary key the primary key of parent table will become will become foreign key in child table okay na? and then we need to establish the primary key and what foreign key relationship between the tables if one to many are many to one relation exists the primary key of parent table will become foreign key in child table so here what happen means uh, rules to be followed while applying foreign key what are the rules to be followed while applying foreign key rule number one minimum minimum two columns must minimum uh, two tables must exist two tables must exist and common column must exist between the table common column must exist between the table common column must exist between the table so here let us see here all of you so here if you observe clearly state and city one state can have many cities so parent table is state child table is city the primary key of parent table will become foreign key in what child table so if you want to establish the relationship between both the tables what to do create a separate column in child table same primary key column state id but this is foreign key actually not primary key okay now here state id is one column i created and here what to do uh, hyderabad belongs to telangana st1 warangal also belongs to telangana st1 vizag belongs to ap st2 is it clear everyone so here, uh, uh, apply the what here you can see okay now two tables are there this is your in city table state id is what foreign key in city table state id is foreign key this is your state table in state table state id is primary key in city table state id is foreign key the primary key of parent table will become foreign key in the child table remove this employee table for time being there is no place and similarly establish the relation between parent and child now city and location one city can have many locations is it clear one city can have many locations so parent table is city child table is location so the primary key of parent table will become foreign key in child table so in location table what to do create one more column as city id with columns gachibowli belongs to hyderabad city one amirpet belongs to hyderabad city one nad belongs to vizag city two like this you can apply what foreign key relation between the tables okay now so here you have how many tables are there here you have three tables are there first one is state table having two columns state id and state name second one is city table having three columns city id city name and state id third one is location table having three columns okay now and these all are foreign keys actually in city table state id is foreign key in a location table city id is foreign key the primary key of one table will become foreign key in another table this is how you can draw the convert the year diagram into database uh, physical database is it clear everyone so year diagram means entity relationship diagram whenever you want to develop any project first of all we need to concentrate on the requirement first we need to gather the data depending on the requirement and then we need to apply what uh, establish the relationship between the entities so how to convert the year diagram into physical database these are the steps 
okay na see if you are not creating the dividing the tables multiple tables the main problem is data redundancy will be increased okay na generally normalization normalization in the database design technique which is used to reduce the redundancy and dependency or at the time of storing the data in the database table we need to store the data in the form of tables which is collection of rows and columns the main point is we must not uh, uh, store the duplicate values to avoid the redundancy and dependency we'll try to apply normalization that anyway we'll discuss in the next video i hope you understood in this video we discussed about how to convert the year diagram into a physical database for more videos try to subscribe to this channel share like and click on the bell icon thank you have a nice day